doesn't like me to change it either. Pretending the way. Let's see if I can get this so it can be seen. A little bit of a reflection there. So I can use the glove, this glove as well, pretty nicely. And this is in wet mode. Oh, I forgot, that doesn't work. So, it'd be nice to double tap that and get straight into details instead of hitting into details. This works pretty good. Discard reason gives me trouble all the time. There it goes. There's a slight delay with it apparently. And this needs to be a little bit bigger. It's kind of hard to see. So it's nice. It's fine out here, but when it go when it opens up, somewhere we might want to break this. Oh no, we can't. We've got other stuff going on there. Alright, uh, let's see. So it'd be good to go straight into species here is what I see happening. So we definitely want that. So then I come back. That's good. Let me look at the scale. Put my counts in. This is good. Can't check anything else. This isn't working over here yet. So that, that part's pretty good. But let me add some water here. This is fresh water. Before, yeah, see, now it doesn't know where I'm touching anymore. So when you add it, when you get it too wet, it kind of freaks out. But if I use the stylus when it's wet, we're okay. I can actually see this a bit better than I could yesterday. We're more overcast today. But when it's wet, Glove. Oh, I should probably do it in something else. So the, the, the touch aspect is much more difficult when wet. Let me see what happens when I dry it off or get that squeegee on it. I think a squeegee that's the actual size of the screen would work much better. Okay. Now we're back. Of course, the size of the glove you use will have a little bit of play on it. This one's too big to, to really get in there. This one's a little more fine. So if you're wearing bulky gloves, you'll want to, you'll be needing to use the pen anyway. This one has two types of pen. This is a metal tip pen and that's all it is. Uh, it works all right. But when I add water, I think this one stops working too. Let me check. Okay. The screen's all funky. As you can see, it's starting to light up. I don't know how to make that. Okay. So yeah. So now I've got the metal tip pen. And it, it works. But nowhere near as well as this. Huh? And I haven't checked, I need to check a stylus that's not one of these active styluses. I don't know how these are going to hold up. This looks like this one's okay. The one from Panasonic just sucked. But it would be nice if this most recent list and full list worked. Um, and see right here, see how it still says wrap? The moment I say okay, it gets rid of it. It didn't add it. I would think okay should add. 
Um, so there's no entry function, like if I'm typing something and I get it, I have to select it over here, then I have to hit add, or I can double tap it, I think it shows up, but I can't see, see how the keyboard's taking over the whole thing? So if we're gonna do this, the keyboard probably better off down here, and maybe an auto scroll so you can see what's here, or add from the top so that I can see when it gets added, because I can't tell whether or not it got added. And even if I hit okay, the only way to get rid of that rat is to hit clear. And now the whole thing's back. So that needs to work a lot better. I don't know if I have my glove on there or not. Um, and it, I don't see inverts. So inverts didn't get added for some reason. So let me try that away again. So that should have added it, right? No. That didn't add it either. Add added it. So double tap's not working sometimes. I thought it should work. See, and I got no way to clear this unless I go back to the typing, which I don't like for sure. This, when it's wet, it's not working. There it goes. When it's dry, that does work pretty well. So let me see if I can change that. A full blown. Okay, now that it's dry, I flick. Now that the. There you go. Now that it's dry, I flick works nicely. And in some ways, it's easier. And now, double tap and adding is working. So that's easier in some ways. So as long as it's dry, flip is pretty nice. Um, so it'd be nice to just double click these instead of hitting edit details. This card reason still giving me trouble there. I don't know if you can see very well. Yeah. It's a delay or something. You know, and I haven't tried these. Oh, it's not going in. I guess these aren't working yet. All right, we'll just assume they're just kind of there. Uh, go back to that. Go back. So all that's there. Straight to species. There should be no species there because it's a series of ones. But it'd be nice if the things that might be in that grouping automatically came up. Um, it's not. Oh, that's right. We can't double tap to add species. Now, can I? Okay, but I can't do that. All right. I don't know how I feel about that. It'd be really helpful to get these most recent and full lists set so that they retain what I've done. Um, I'm wondering if that's enough to tell you where you are. Video. Oh. Notes. That's Vince. We won't tell you what he just did. I don't even know. I can't blame it on him, maybe. I'm going to blame it on a knot. It's all a knot's fault. That was interesting. I noticed there was something in there already. Anytime you come to a new screen, this calculator should be clear. There shouldn't be numbers in it already. These these don't function yet. Mainly right here, I can't really test biospecimens, it'd be nice to. Um, and I definitely can see the read to like, oh crap, I weighed all those under barnacles and they were supposed to be. Um, so it'd be nice to be able to edit like this and say, when you edit details, reassign the catch category. Can we do that? So that might be where you'd need to do it if your subspecies, if the species level baskets should have gone to a different catch category somehow. And we definitely have to think about removing. Now I also have a trouble with this. I need to block windows because it'll pull things over from the side. And I keep getting. It'd be nice if everything disappeared and couldn't be activated by water. And I don't know if I can do it. 
I tried auto hiding this and it didn't work out too well. I had it on auto hide. The problem with that is it doesn't pull our thing big enough. I would like this. Yeah, I just can't get it. Our box tends to slide around. That this the software won't stay put. See how I'm sliding it? It doesn't lock in anywhere. This is Windows 10. I have a similar problem on 7. I just can't get the size to fill the screen. And there it goes. All right, now it's full screen. But then things happen really easy that get rid of this. So we need it to be a, a full screen Windows 10 and get edge to edge and not be movable. There's definite problems with that. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, let's see. Normally we go back to halls. You need to go upstairs and times. I'm not sure about add location, edit location. Unless, yeah, we need to be able to define whether this, it says up automatically, but what if this is an additional location instead? We need to be able to sign it. Um, I might be better off with these being set, retrieve, additional, as in three different buttons so that it does it automatically. That would be quicker. We have room for that. Um, even if you're adding a get GPS, you need that to be a toggle and then add your location so that it gets it from the GPS but knows whether it's up, down, or a other one. So we need some way to assign that. And I think having the buttons will be better. Um, this pad, absolutely impossible to see. It does, however, work when it's wet. That's the hardest time with this one. This is at other programs. One thing I like about it so far is the law. Um, it, it does work no matter what. When it was wet, I could still get in. The problem is I can barely, I can't see shit on this one. There it is. And it won't give me a keyboard when I, there it is. It's just really hard to see. Okay, I'm in. How do I make this keyboard go away? I did like Let's see if I can get back out it's really hard to see their stuff um, not even sure how to get here okay so they've got begin hall end hall as separate spots so you say now then it goes and gets a GPS which I don't know if it's on that's kind of what we might want for ours as well I don't know if GPS is actually valid on this Oh, there. Wow, has it been an hour? Nine. Yeah, we gotta pick up. We're home. Something happened or? Yeah, 